Welcome to DeVos Fieldhouse, home of Hope College Volleyball and Basketball, and this November site of the 2012 NCAA Division III Volleyball National Championships. Today on a Highlight Reel, we spotlight a team looking to make it all the way, well, here. We're all access with a newer, stronger, bigger Flying Dutch Volleyball team. Come to DeVos Fieldhouse for a volleyball match this fall, and you will see a larger roster than usual on the Hope side. Coach Becky Schmidt has a perfectly good explanation for what seems like a sudden surplus in players. The mega team uh, is just where we're keeping everybody on the varsity team regard, uh, instead of having a, two separate teams. Um, and the reason that we're doing that is because we wanted to try to have a little bit more competition between the players and to uh, keep people on their toes throughout the entire season. Coach Schmidt, now in her ninth season with the team, believes that while the mega team may be different than anything she's done in the past, the setup is one that any Hope player can relate to. It's a trademark of our, of our program is that there's competition all the time, um, and, and they're, they're responding well to it. A larger team means larger responsibilities for the Dutch captains, including Mary Schoolmaster, a junior middle hitter from Portage. But she says there isn't any added pressure to her new title. Everyone's just so supportive. It doesn't feel like it's us and them. It's just a collective work. <laughs> so we're, we're a bit in the, uh, yeah, in the war zone here. We are in the war yeah. zone. After making sure there was no imminent danger where we were standing, Schoolmaster talked more about the team dynamic. The great thing about our program is we don't really have the hierarchy of who's looking up to who. We all give each other feedback. We all are there for each other and support each other in the same way. So it's kind of just a collective group thing. As with every Hope College sport, the team's success lies in how it performs against its arch rival. Hope finished 25-7 and last season, but four times lost to league champion Calvin. Coach Schmidt on her squad's chances in the rivalry this year. I think that it's going to take consistency of playing at a high level. And last year, I think that we were just a little bit too kind of um, up and down um, and weren't able to put long runs of points together against them. I think that we're definitely going to be able to have the team that's going to be able to do that this year. And if they can get past the Knights this season, a rare reward awaits in November. DeVos Fieldhouse is hosting the 2012 NCAA Division III Volleyball National Championship, meaning Hope has a chance to add to its banner collection while playing for the hometown crowd. We aren't, you know, shying away from talking about it. It's definitely something that we are, are working hard to be able to do and to, to compete in that tournament, but we know that it's going to take a lot to be able to, to do that. Hope has started out 12 and 1 this season against some of the best competition in the land. To find out when you can catch the Dutch in action at DeVos Fieldhouse, plus information on all fall sports, just go hope.edu/athletics. We'll see you next time on Highlight Reel.